Dolukanda is a well-known mountain range due to the Dolukanda Buddhist temple. Also, many pieces of evidence have been found that Dolukanda was the medicinal garden of King Buddha Dasa. History has it that he was an amazing king who amazed the world with his hella medicine. But there is another story to be read about the history of Dolukanda. It is believed that the mountain is directly linked to the great Indian epic Ramayana trail in Sri Lanka. In the Ramayana story, this mountain is declared Dolukanda Sanjeevani mountain. This is one of the five Sanjeevani drops in Sri Lanka which is located in Kurunagara district. This is one of the popular Ramayana sites of Sri Lanka where it is believed that the parts of Himalaya mountain have been felt while it was carried to Sri Lanka by Hanuman. So this adventure begins at Colombo, where I took an early morning bus to Kurunagala to meet my friend Tosita. We had something to eat and got some stuff for our camping. From there, we headed towards the starting point of the trail. So we started the hike. Uh, you have to come to a temple. So from that temple only, the path leads to the, uh, the trail. So you see that my friend had gone once, so he said it will take around roughly two to three hours to reach the top. But with our stuff at the moment, it might take long because it's only me and him. We are carrying a lot of water, food, uh, but I think we, love, we are in good hands. We have two guides with us, him and that guy over there. Do you see that? We always get companions. So they will lead us even if we get lost. They know the path. Uh, so it's at the moment 10 a.m. in the morning. Right sunny. Weather is very dry. So definitely we'll get a, a lot dehydrated we brought a lot of water because we are not sure if there will be water up, up. so seems a, seems like a very tough journey oh poor lady not in a good shape <laughs> so we'll see you guys on the top made it to the first viewpoint. We have come to the place, to the cave, I mean. Finally, uh, it took us about Three and a half hours. Uh, to be honest, we were we took a lot of uh, breaks in between because we didn't want to rush. Because both of us are doing a hike like this for after a very very long time, so we didn't want to exhaust ourselves. So, oh, very close, very close. Let me show you guys. Hi. 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 Hi.
सोलो हाइकिंग सोलो We are going to spend the night. absorb the whatever so this is Rukanda uh, we are we have been here now uh, for like half, half an hour we were I was very tired and my friend was very tired so we just took some a little rest uh, we went to uh, find some water but uh, unfortunately that water puddle which was there before it's all dried out because it's very dry season here and it has not rained for days so we are having a small trouble when it comes to water but we have two and a half uh, water bottles at the moment so we'll try to manage uh, with that uh, for coffee in the evening and then dinner and then next uh, tomorrow morning coffee and breakfast and the down uh, way down also so we'll try to manage it uh, it's very cool here very cool the way up was uh, even though we were covered uh, with trees there were very little wind coming so it was very uh, humid so very tiring i was so glad to see the stains already here so let me show you our uh, luxury stay So this cave is believed to be used by the Buddhist monks to meditate, but now mostly it's been used by travelers to camp. This is the place we decided to sleep since it was a better surface to rest. Now all we had to do was to make some coffee, enjoy the sunset, send the drone of course and prepare some dinner, get to bed and wake up for a beautiful sunrise. beautiful sunrises wherever you are in Sri Lanka you will if you are in a top if you are in a mountain top on the side or even Kalam sometimes you can get a nice sunrise uh, so last night was rough uh, because all the wind which comes from there gets cooped up and go come inside there so like past uh, midnight Then it became very uh, cool. So now even now it's very cool. Like we are in like a, we are getting like some very AC experience. So the plan is now, uh, as I told, it's 6:30. So we are 
try to So it's very hard to stay here. So this is already going to be starting on the fire. Um, so I don't know because we want to yeah, have a bath also. There, there's a small lake, he said, but you have to take another wash and go another way because we are actually we are very filthy. <laughs> so we want to get some water in our bodies. So we have to do that also. That's one of the reasons that we want to go early. Uh, I will try to send the drone another one last time because uh, there was a small uh, signal issue yesterday when I sent it in uh, the evening. Uh, so I'm a bit uh, worried about that, but we'll try to get another one more try in the morning. Signals are very nice. So hopefully, I hope you all like the video. I think this is my first time in a video in English and uh, just wanted to try something new and if you are planning to come uh, you have to uh, inform the temple and if you are the, if, if this is your first time you definitely need a guide uh, if there is a trail you can uh, come through the food trail which is already there but if you <laughs> get a dog they will anyway lead you up but it's better if, if it's your first time uh, to come with a guide uh, bring plenty of water the only problem is uh, when it's very dry season no water at all up it's very hard to find water so bringing a lot of water up also is not a easy task so be careful of that be mindful of that uh, but nonetheless if you can definitely come up here uh, enjoy the view Uh, or any traveler who goes around just enjoy it get all the experience that you can and then take all the memories don't know, leave anything else so I hope you all enjoyed the video uh, all right. so then guys uh, as always then stay safe wear a mask see you in the next one In centuries past, during the time of the singular kings, historical landmarks, forest and animal life were an important part of the social fabric. This is just one of many locations in Sri Lanka that is part of that history. As travelers, it's our responsibility to make sure that we become an example to protect these historical points in time. <laughs>